The All City Dive Meet started today at Goodman Pool in Madison. The All City Swim portion starts Thursday at Ridgewood Pool. It's really a week-long party that celebrates a 60th anniversary this week. It's a gathering of kids and families in Madison that in many ways is the envy of the swimming community nationwide. Eric Franke has the story. There were maybe 200 swimmers. Now there's 25, 2600. There is nothing that captures the spirit of summertime in Madison like all city swim and dive meet week. There's nothing that compares to the all city. Other people say, how does this happen? Tom Wenzel swam in all city as a kid. He coached, he's been a parent and now a grandparent to a swimmer. He's watched it grow from its infancy. He even remembers early races on Lake Monona at BB Clark Beach. The lakes were a little cleaner then, so you could kind of see the bottom, but the Ridgewood people, one of our favorite stories was the young lady on our team stopped the whole meet because there was a dead perch floating in her lane. <laughs> Soon the only fish in the water were the kids themselves. Five original pools, Hill Farm, Ridgewood, Maple Bluff, Westside, and Shorewood started the all city league back in 1962. The size of the meat is, I, I don't think we ever thought it was going to get to this big. Stan Richter big. ran the Hill Farm pool for yeah. almost 40 years. It was basically done in one day and the pools weren't closed. Uh, now the pools basically are closed almost all week long in preparation for this humongous big event. By the late 60s, those meets in the lake came to an end, and eight more pools have joined the league, most recently Goodman Pool in 2011. It just started to balloon, and thankfully they have what they call the Bible, and that passes from each team that hosts to the next team with all the good things to do, all the things to avoid. It's gotten to be about that thick. Putting it all together takes volunteers months. And with all the folks cheering on their swimmers, more than 5,000 people are expected this week at Ridgewood Pool. It's gotten so big, Eric, that I noticed on the website that Ridgewood is selling parking passes down there, selling parking spots there for 40 bucks. Everything was very low key. Uh, it was just go through it, get over with it, and four o'clock, we all went home. And now, at 4 o'clock, well, we got the relays to go through. Yet 60 years later, at its core, it's still all about one thing. You can feel the enthusiasm, the tent city. I know that Ridgewood is going to try to get all those tents in there. And to give the kids a feeling of the camaraderie that it's, it's there. The whole tent city that you've seen where they have every team, well, the large teams have their own tent, the smaller ones share. Well, you know, you'll find if, if you know, your kid's missing, they'll be in somebody else's tent. It is really cool. Oh. Hanging out at the pool, competing, and being among friends. Classic summertime in Madison, Wisconsin. Eric Franke, News 3 Now.